Hey y'all, welcome back to another vlog. This is our very first vlog in a long time. We are here at Disney Springs. Today is the very first day that Disney Springs is open. Not even all of the stores are not open yet, only some of them, but we were missing the parks so much. Um, Abby's not with me today because she is at home doing YouTube work for you guys. But I just came to vlog some of the day to show you what the new differences look like as far as taking uh, measures for safety for everyone. So I'm gonna show you what looks different than a normal day at the Springs. And yeah, the very first one of those is face masks. We have got to wear face masks if you want to enter any of the Disney properties. And yeah, so I don't even know if you can hear me right now. It's going to be a new adventure to try to vlog through a mask, but I'm excited to be here. I hope you guys are excited to be here and let's look at Disney Springs. To be honest, I'm just excited that the magic is back and that the Disney World is spinning once again. <laughs> Over here on Chicken Guy, they have the six feet apart merchants on the floor, so everybody knows where to stand. Lots of new cool signage. entrance because obviously there are no buses coming in right now so that's a nice hallway way to just sit if you don't want to be near people their doors are open over there so anthropology is open so as of today the Disney stores are not open so ever after jewelry world of Disney like none of those are open it's mostly just third-party stores shore is closed Ron Don is open! Ready for business. So they have a lot of different spacing things at World of Disney here. To try to keep people from standing too close to each other. They do have the, sorry we're closed, because they are opening on the 27th. I don't know if you can see anything in there. But it does say enter here. So these are gonna be the entry doors. And then you probably have to funnel and exit out the other side door but you have to stand six feet apart from everybody in line the news is in folks starbucks is open and it is popular per usual but you can just see they have the six feet apart line on the floor 
so we're really trying to keep everybody spaced out. Yeah, so that's what I thought. This World of Disney door here on the side has the exit only uh, signs on it. You'll enter through this side door and then exit through these doors. This one's an exit only as well. So one entrance and two exits. So basin is open and they do have the six foot lines as well. So interesting to note that Basin is basically doing all of their safety precautions through their cast members. So there are lines on the floor before you enter, but there are no sneeze guards, there are no like closed fountains. They're just trying to limit the amount of things that people touch. So they don't want you to put your hands into the salts or the bath, you know, bombs. They don't want you to touch everything until you decide what you're gonna buy and then the cast member will assist you in putting that together. This is Ariba's Brothers, and they also have the lines on the floor. Welcome. your nose and mouth with the mask or a tissue or anything really so as I said earlier the all of the Disney stores are not open so pin traders the Christmas store trendy they're not quite open yet here on the first day so they're getting their cleaning and they're getting ready to open in the next week thing on this side that's really open is Earl of Sandwich, which is a fabulous thing to open. This is the entrance for the walking trail. So you do still have to go through the same kind of tent, temperature checks, make sure you're wearing a face mask, um, but you can also walk into the springs as well as drive into the parking lots. So they have um, one entrance in the lime parking lot open and two in the orange parking lot. Hey you, I've missed you. Dublin has put out a ton of outdoor seating and I am here for it because those indoor tables are very very close together but they are not quite open yet still working on getting those doors open but we can wait because we're coming for you so Raglan is not open just yet I think I will be interested to see how that looks when they reopen it because all those tables are very close together and it's a very much like pub atmosphere. Yeah, more arrows. These are my favorite. 
<laughs> I love these. A little bit too far to skip from one to the other, but you know, here's hoping. Beautiful Disney Springs. So glad to be back. Sprinkles is closed currently, as well as their ATM. So sad. Uh, Pandora is open, but they're limiting the number of people in. So they have a few lines outside and it looks like they have a line. How exciting. I always root for the stores that have lines outside because I know how hard this time is on businesses. So good for them. So Deluxe will not be opening until the 27th, which is a week from the day that I'm filming this, which I believe right now um, Disney will be opening somewhere around there with all of their stores. But so far I'm seeing a fairly positive turnout for people coming today, even though it's mostly third party stores that are open. So I was curious to see if because the Disney stores weren't open, if it if people weren't gonna come because there wasn't Disney merch, but so far I'm pleasantly surprised. So our fave, guess what's open? Blaze Pizza. Uh, multiple restaurants have pulled out outdoor seating where there wasn't any before, um, but they pulled out more outdoor seating so that they can get more people, you know, seated and, and fed um, while still being safe. I do love the wide open space that comes with them doing social distancing. They're not letting as many people in and I do love being able to walk around with no people. Kind of nice. One thing we forgot to mention, an important thing, is that Coca-Cola is currently closed. That is a bummer because I do love their Coke Icy's. But Chicken Guy will be opening as well as Wolfgang Puck's Bar and Grill. You know how we feel about Wolfgang Puck's Bar and Grill. I'm here for it. Disney style is not open. They are very much closed. It's all dark and sad in there. Oh, so sad. The balloon is obviously not operating. It is an extremely windy day today. And I don't even know how that's going to work like once everything is back because they can't put too many people on the balloon at one time. Footsville is closed. So is the NBA experience. And obviously the surf tent is closed. I'm curious to see if House of Blues is closed um, because I've heard some mixed, mixed signals. So we shall see. Oh, so they are not open at House of Blues. Here is the signage. House of Blues is not open yet. Alright guys, I am going to wrap up this vlog here. I'm just sitting in this bench in the shade, just enjoying being in the Disney bubble, being here. I hope that you guys have enjoyed this. If you loved seeing the look of Disney Springs on the first day, please give this video a thumbs up. Consider subscribing to our channel as we will be giving lots more updates on the parks as they reopen. We'll see you next time. Bye!